So today's Scott Jelly mini movie is called I Fell in Love with an Alien and this story is by Blue Sky so I will have the original in the description down below and let me know what other gotcha stories you'd like to see me react to next. Friday, October 11th, 8.45 a.m. You see that guy beside her? That's my ex-best friend, Elijah. He left me three years ago to be popular. These are my friends, Penny and Ryan. They both like each other, but won't admit it. I've been friends with them for almost six years. Hey, lovebirds. We're not dating. You're not, but you both have feelings for each other, right? No, if you say so. And you guys are wearing the same pants again. For the third time this week. Anyways, are we still on for tonight? Duh. Sorry, bro. I was asking Penny, not you. Why can't I come on your date? It's not a date, for gonna say. Yeah, yeah, totally. Okay, okay, fine. I'll stop. Yeah, you should before he punches you. Anyways, I need to head to class now. Okay, see you later, bro. Whoa. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. I don't need your help. Um, okay, I'll be leaving now. Friday, October 11th, 4.57 p.m. Hi, my name is Landon. May I take your order? Uh, yes. Yeah. So I'll have a salad. Is that all, sir? Yep. Kylie, one salad pronto. Hey, Landon. Oh, hey, boss. Didn't see you there. I need to talk to you. Am, am I in trouble? Of course not. Okay, so what do you want to tell me? You know how Kevin hasn't been feeling well this week. I need you to take the night shift for him. I'll pay you three times extra. This can really help your mom with her surgery. Okay, we'll do it. Uh, nobody even comes here this late. What time even is it? 1.34 a.m. I mean, at least I only have one more hour left. Huh? What was that noise? Maybe I should check it out. Someone might be hurt. I believe it was from here. What is that? I should really get back to work. No, someone might be in trouble. Maybe I should try moving this. What is that? I should move this fast. It looks hurt. Gosh, that was heavy. I should help it. It's actually pretty light. I should hide whatever this is in the cave. It looks cold. I should probably call Lynn. Hello. Hey, Lynn, I needed to come home. Why? I'm at work right now. You're still at work? Yeah, for mom. But I can leave early in like five minutes. So, why did you want me home? And what's that behind you? I'll let you see yourself. What in the world is that? I don't know, but I'm pretty sure it's not human nor animal. Get that thing out of here before it hurts us. No, she's not going to hurt us. I mean, look at her. Does it look like she will hurt us? And what are we going to do with it? Well, we can't just give it to the authorities. Who knows what they'll do to her? Can we please keep it? Fine, but I don't trust it. If she hurts me or you, I'm sending her to the authorities. Thank you, sis. Saturday, October 12th, 10.55 a.m. Uh, wow. Oh, hey, looks like you got up. Uh, hey, don't be scared. I won't hurt you. No hurt? Yes, I won't hurt you. I promise. Anyways, what's your name? Name? Yeah, it's something you call someone. No name. Oh, sorry. I didn't know you didn't have a name. What about uh, I give you a name? Name. What about Rui? Ooh. Rui! I'm guessing you like that name. So, Rui, do you want to go to the park? Park? Yep, I left clothes on the table. Meet me outside when you're done. Hey, guys, isn't that the dork over there? Yeah, and who is that with him? Elijah, do you know who that is since you used to be friends with him? Oh, I've never seen her. Why don't we give them a visit? Look at what we have here. Can you just leave us alone? What about no? What do you even want from us? Oh, we don't want any anything from you. We just want to talk to your little girlfriend. The girlfriend? Stop giving your false information and leave. No, I don't want to. Get a life and leave. Uh, my glasses. Maybe you should think before you start being rude to Ellie. Stop! Really? Handsome, you're late. Uh, my name is Landon, not handsome. Handsome. Landon. Handsome. Landon. I give up, you won. Anyways, have you seen my glasses? Glasses? Yeah, everything is blurry without them. Uh, what are you doing? Uh, Rui! What happened? I can see! Did you do this? And I thought I would never be able to see without my glasses. Thank you so much. Wow, is that what it looks like away? And why is she wearing mom's clothes? She didn't have any other clothes that fit her. Well, kinda. And don't worry, she won't do anything to mom's stuff. Fine, but as I said before, I don't trust her. Anyways, where are your glasses? Oh, I don't need them anymore. But didn't the doctor 
Sandra say that you'll need glasses forever? Really, over your helped me. She did something to help me see. Are you for real? Or is this some joke for me to like the alien? Really help. Thank you so much for helping my baby brother. Sunday, October 13th, 9.56 a.m. We can't leave her home alone. Knowing that she has powers, the authority will take her right away. Can you bring her to work and say that she's your sister or something? Unfortunately, I can't. I'm not allowed to bring people to work. Hey, Rui. Hey, Hanson. Stop calling me that. I'm not even handsome. Anyways, do you have any way to hide your features? Features? Yeah, so less people will notice you and they'll probably think you're human. So, what should we do with her? Let's see if we can make her look human. You promise? No hurt, boy. What do you mean? I would never hurt you. I was just asking so we could hide you from the authorities if I bring you to school. No, I can't hide my features. Well, I can do this. Uh, Rui, where did you go? Over here. Oh, so you're that floating cupcake? Yep, and I'm invisible so you can't see me. Can you change back? Well, I can only stay invisible for an hour. It's fine. You can figure out something. Anyways, what is this school place that we're going? Oh, it's a place where you learn and make friends. I can also make friends. No, because we don't want people finding out about you. It's okay, I still have hands on. Landon. Monday, October 14th, 8.30 a.m. She's invisible, that's why you can't see her. Okay, so don't talk, okay? Okay. Stay by me the whole time. Hey, guys. Yo, where did your glasses go? I don't need them anymore. I thought you were going to need glasses forever. Never say never. Okay, you can come out now. Were those people your friends? Yeah, but... I I guess I'm the third wheel now. We have to get to class, so you should probably turn invisible again. Now I have nothing to do. Isn't that Allie and Melanie? I don't know if you noticed or not. The dork lost his glasses, and all the girls are all going crazy over him. I know. It's annoying. But what are we gonna do about that idiot Elijah? Oh, that's simple. On prom, we're going to ruin his popularity. But first, we gotta take all his money. money. Actually mean those things about Elijah? Do you come here all the time? Well, only if I'm feeling lonely. We're friends. They're probably with each other. Why are you not with them? Well, they're both dating now, and I'm probably going to be seeing them less and less. But that's fine. I have you, huh? Where's Ellie and Melody? They told me to meet them here. Huh? Landon, go before it gets you! Don't worry, she's not going to hurt you. Really? No hurt! She's really kind and loving once you get to know her. Please don't tell anyone about her. <sighs> Okay, fine, I won't. But I need you to do me a favor. Please forgive me. What? I don't understand. Just get up, you big idiot. You have no idea how much I missed you. I missed you too. Well, I'll see you later. I gotta find Ellie. Ellie, yeah, wait! I didn't get to tell him about Ellie and Melanie. He seems like he really cares about you. But are you sure we can trust him? I trust him. Who's that? Oh, it's Lynn. Hey, Lynn, why are you calling me? <gasps> what? Come on. We need to go. I'm here. Oh, you brought Rui? Yeah, but how's mom? I don't know. The doctors didn't tell me anything yet. Right now, we just have to wait and hope for the best. Why is him so sad? <laughs> Found you. I have some news I want to tell you both about your mother. Your mother's survival chance has increased thanks to our doctors. And the bad news is that she needs her surgery in two weeks or there will be no, no chance, chance of survival. survival. Okay, we understand. I know what they're Dude, are you okay? You seem off today. You can tell us. We'll help you with whatever's wrong. My mother, the doctor, is saying that she'll die if she doesn't get the surgery. How about we visit her after school? We can get her a bunch of stuff as well. Sure, thank you guys. Of course, we love you. Hey, Mom, how are you? It's been a while, hasn't it? I've missed you so much. I've got you some flowers, your favorite. Um, the doctor would like to see Landon and Alicia Woods. He'll be right back. You surely mean a lot to them. You know I love them very much. She always make me happy. Now they're both sad. I hope I get to meet you one day. I really hope this works. <laughs> really? It's time to go. Really? What happened? I don't know. I just found her on the floor. Let's bring her home. Friday, December 2nd, 3.46 p.m. Please be okay. You're all I have. <sighs> Landon! Really? 
Joey! What happened? It doesn't matter as long as you're okay. Come on, let's go see Alicia. She must be very excited to see you. Mom! Landon, you've grown up so much. I've missed you so much. Mom, it's fine. It's not your fault. Thank you for being here. You should be thanking your alien friend. She's the reason why I got the energy to get up. Thank you so much. I don't know what I would have done without you. Well, it's been a few months. My and Rui's relationship has grown stronger. Me and my mom are catching up. She's doing much better, and now she's breathing fine and healthier. Rui has started attending school. For real this time. Me, Elijah, and Rui are still good friends. Elijah stopped being friends with Ali and Mia since he had found out that they're fake. I had even started developing feelings for Rui. Tuesday, February 6, 7.21 p.m. Hey, we're home. About time, it's 7. Is Rui okay? It's pretty cold today. Hey, Rui, are you cold? Rui fine. If you say so. Landon, can you do something for me? Can you go to some fast food place and pick up some food for us? Why can't you? I'm in my PJs and I don't feel like changing. I can come too. Yeah, you're not coming. But Rui we want to come too. Don't worry, I'll be back soon. Okay. Uh, where am I? I've never been here before. Am I lost? Where do you think you're going? Boss, I got him. When is he going to be home? Don't worry, he'll be back soon. Okay, I guess you miss him. Yeah. Where are you? It's so late. Where is he? <gasps> it's him. Hey, Landon. What? What's this? I have your friend. If you ever want to see him again, come to the lab. XO Love, your master. Hey, this is the last time. I remember this place. I need to hurry up and see Landon. Uh, where am I? Yeah, look who woke up. What? You've been kidnapped. What do you even want from me? Oh, we don't want anything from you. We're just using you as bait so that alien will come here to save you and we can take her. You won't get away with this. Just watch us. I hope Rui will be okay. Go, oh, be free from this place. What about you? Don't worry about me. Abigail! Leave now! Abby! Pinky! I can't believe I'm seeing you again. It's been so boring without you here, Pinky. Just call me Rui. Anyways, what brings you here? Well, they have kidnapped my friend. And I need to save him before they do anything to him. I think I saw them bring in someone that way. Thanks, Abby. Where are they? I checked almost everywhere. Oh, look who it is. The dumb alien that ran away. The name's Rui. <laughs> so you got a name now. Where's Landon? Oh, that boy. My assistant has him. <laughs> Who's laughing now? Don't worry, you're not the only one who gained strength. I did as well. Oh, really? Well, I'll be leaving now. <laughs> <laughs> what the heck? Remember that experiment I was working on? It worked! Well, let's see who's stronger. Ha! Now my turn. Ha! Well, looks like I won. <laughs> Not yet! Ha! Next time, don't mess with me. About time you made it. Let him go! Nope. You're going to pay for this. Kai, get her. Now say bye-bye to your friend. You said you won't hurt him. Never trust your enemies. Land it! for the best months of my time. Now it's my turn to save you. Uh -huh. Oh, you've finally woken up. I'll go call your family. How long have I been sleeping for? Three months. What? Landon! Oh, hey. Where's Rui? She she's gone. Oh, yeah. What do you mean? Rui. Here, she wanted you to have this. I'll leave you alone for a little bit. Hi, Landon. It's me, Rui. I don't have very much energy left, but I just want to say a few things. You mean the world to me. Don't cry over me. I'm just an alien. You'll find someone. Elijah told me about this feeling. I don't know what it is, but I feel it whenever I'm around you. He said something about lovers. If I had more time, I would love to be lovers. I'm going back to my planet since my loss of energy. I hope I can see you in the future. Thank you for the best months of my life. I'll never forget you. Rui, I will never forget you. You're the best thing that happened to me. I love you too. <gasps> that was so sweet. So that was I Fell in Love with an Alien, a Got to Life mini movie by Blue Skies. I will have the original in the description down below. Let me know what other gotcha stories you'd like to see me react to next. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give it a like. And if you're new, subscribe to become a mermaid or a merman. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys.